how to create a course on Wix for beginners. Hey guys, welcome back. Today I will be showing you how you can get started with creating your own course on Wix. So let's get into it. Now, building your own website with Wix is super easy and simple, and you can use any kind of template to get started. However, adding features like courses, your shop, or any other kind of feature can be a little tricky if you've never done it before. So I'm going to break it down step by step precisely what you need to do to start selling your online course or to even sell physical classes if you want. So let's get into adding our course platform or course selling platform to our Wix website. Now, if you don't know how to build a Wix website, make sure to check out our other videos on our channel, which will explain to you and break down how you can get started with building your website. Now, I have already built my website. This is just a website template that I'm using to show you guys this specific uh, tutorial because I'm just going to have this empty template. I didn't change anything in it. You can obviously edit your own website. If you're just testing Wix out, you can test it out on a template as well. Now, to get started with selling a course, the first thing you need to do is open the website editor on Wix. So you can just go into My Sites on Wix and then click on Select Site and start editing your website. Once you have opened up the Wix website editor, which usually can take a couple of seconds to open up, you will be able to see your basic Wix website editor. From here, what you want to do is that in your left navigation panel, you have a add apps section. So you have this little icon that has four boxes and you just want to click on that. This is the Wix app market. Now to integrate courses on Wix, you can use a simple native to Wix app called the Wix online course app, where you can get started with building your online courses directly with Wix. So all you have to do is search for so just search for Wix online programs and you guys can see just like that you can start selling your online programs or online courses on Wix. So for that you will just click on add to site and there are some alternative tools available as well that you can use to build your courses on Wix. However, the one that is natively provided by Wix usually integrates better into your pre-existing website. So it's just a lot easier for you to integrate that. Now, keep in mind, I've just integrated this directly onto my home page. If you want to do it on any other page, you can see that it will create the new page for you and you can just rename that page into whatever you want. So I have the program list over here. And once you have your program list or once you have this new page created, you can manage this page and rename it. So let's say I'm providing courses on home maintenance. So I'm going to click on manage pages over here. So now from the left panel, you can rename any of your programs or any of your courses that you want to sell on your Wix website. So as you guys can see over here, if you go into pages and menus and you click on program pages, you will be able to see the multiple different lists, the pages and the payment page, how those are going to be arranged onto your Wix website. So you can really rearrange them, change the names of those pages. Now. One thing to keep in mind is that your site menu is directly not going to include the program page or program page uh, title, whatever you want to rename it to. So you do have to open up your site menu to make sure that the program page is added into your site menu. However you want to place it, you can place it before your shop page, after your shop page, wherever you want to place your programs. Now, once you have added this specific tool or connected this specific application, you want to actually start adding your programs or managing them. You can do this directly from your Wix website editor, but I recommend going into the back end dashboard and getting started from there because it's a lot more convenient and can be a little more hassle free because on the website editor, it already takes a lot of your power. So it's going to be a little bit slow as compared to the back end dashboard. So I just like to save and publish my edits that I've made. And then I'm just going to open up my back end dashboard. So we're going to go into Wix My Sites and we're going to click on Select Site over here to open our dashboard. 
And you guys will be able to see on the left side of your screen, you have this little navigation panel. And in your navigation panel, you will even see your store product if you've integrated products. You also will have your loyalty and referrals, gift cards, orders, and these are all the e com integrations. But below your e com integrations, you will find online programs. So this is the section which you're going to basically format to sell your courses. And you guys will be able to see you can even build categories and different types of programs so first off we're going to get started with building our programs and later on we can categorize them as well now you can choose a pre-existing template of online courses fitness challenge personal coaching nutrition plans or start fresh with a empty slate where you can customize the entire program so let's get started with adding our first program and i'm just going to give it a sample name which might be a bedroom decor course or wall painting course so I've just added wall painting course over here and then you have two options for any type of course. You can either make it a self-paced course where people can choose to complete steps as they like or you can have a scheduled course. Most courses work best when they are scheduled, however, if you are in a specific niche that requires you to create self-paced courses, you can also do that as well. But we're going to continue on with a scheduled one. And then you have the duration. Now, this just really depends on how you're launching your course. If people can join the course whenever they'd like, or if there is going to be a specific start date for all of the members or all of the students that are going to be present within your course. So we're going to go with a specific start date. And let's say the start date is going to be the 20th of August. And let's say the course will end on the 31st. So just like that, you can set up your own particular dates or have a flexible start date. Now, if you have a flexible start date, all you have to do is mention the total duration of the course. So if it's a five day course, if it's like a couple of weeks, however long your particular course is. So we're going to go with a specific date course and we're going to just click on let's go. Now, after this, you will be able to see your program details. So first off, you have your visibility. Who can join this course? You can choose to offer exclusive courses to maybe uh, people that are your high paying clients or customers. You also have the prizes, rewards and groups that you can particularly add to a specific course as well. Now, moving on, you can even create discounts and coupons that can be applicable to the courses. Now, I'm going to click on edit over here and you guys can see I have visibility and pricing. From here, I'm going to make this a public course. However, people should be able to pay to join and I can enter whatever I want to charge per program. You can also choose to charge a subscription based amount. So if you're selling courses that are based on however quick people are to pick up on things, you can charge them based on how long they end up staying in the course. So that can be a subscription based plan as well. But I'm going to charge per program It's going to be a one time fee. And then we have the number of participants. Let's say I'm limiting the number of participants to only 50 participants. So just like that, I would click on save over here. After that, you have your scheduling, your group. You can also connect a particular group just to make it easier once the subscriptions to your course have been completed. Then you have your rewards. So from here, you can set up rewards for your particular course where people can get started with, you know, the milestones that they have to complete. Now, after that, you can add steps or quizzes. So you have two options. Steps are usually the things that you're teaching. These can usually be lectures, videos, or whatever you are teaching, whatever kind of niche you're present in. Obviously, the format of content is going to be different. So you would add that in the form of a step over here. The first step might be painting basics, and I can add my content in the form of video, image, or attach a file. Then you can also insert any kind of link, GIF, or soundtrack, as well as Wix booking services where maybe some steps of the course require a physical location so you can book those as well and those can be present within the course once you've added your content you can click on save over here and the content will be added you can move the content around from here and add a particular step on a particular date then you can start adding quizzes as well so you can enter your quiz and you can add questions in the form of a survey as well so you can add open-ended question multiple choice single choice as well as just text-based questions directly integrated onto wix that will help you in maintaining or you know viewing the progress of your clientele 
You can also choose to require a passing grade, so this can be more helpful if you are selling something that is academic, but if you're selling something that is not really academic, you don't really need the grading system. And just like that, your course will be created on Wix, and now people can get started with purchasing your course online. So this is how you can get started with building your own course on Wix. I hope you guys found this video helpful. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And I will catch you guys in the next video.